guys now, Dad? Almost. No, we're gonna see Mommy, right? Oh, sweet. Uh, about that, we we can't see Mommy. Not yet. It's still a little bit too soon. Then what's the surprise? Well, you are going to be uh, hanging out with me today at Fusion. <laughs> You're gonna be the boss of an entire cosmetics company. How's that sound? Great. To bring you the latest. Get your own desk, of course, an assistant, moi, and the inside <laughs> scoop on all of our fabulous new products. So why are we doing this? Well, it's kind of like take your daughter to work day. Yeah, you've heard of that, right? Yeah, but it's next week. Well, I was so excited. I guess I just got to jump start on it. You could come here every single day for a month and still not see everything there is to be seen. Think of it as a head start on your future as a cosmetics queen. Uh, no, no girls get a chance to do something like this. You should be thinking, Green. So what are we going to do? Well, I thought we would start by showing you the new ad campaign. Can you tell me what you think? Nice. Check it out. Hey. I mean, you, you don't have to do this. I wouldn't. Well, just because, you know, on St. Bart's, things were a little bit tense between you and Emma. And if you have the second thoughts, I'm not. I could take her for the day and we could do it another time Listen, if you want. Emma misses her mom. And she's taking that on me. I'm looking at this as like a fresh start. Get our family back on track. <clears throat> Is that for me? Hey. You like? Do I like it? I love it. Are you kidding me? But what's the occasion? Um, <clears throat> ketchup, uh, mustard. Okay, for your information, that is Dijon, which is French. <laughs> okay, look, I know money's tight, but I thought it was time for an upgrade. You don't want to start your new job with stains on your tie. Today's the day to find out, right? I know, got it? Yeah. Yeah, but how do you know about that? We live in a space the size of a shoebox. There's really no keeping any secrets. So, tell me about the position. Well, if we have no secrets, then you already know everything there is to know. All right, you can ask me yes or no questions. Um, okay, is it something that you would actually enjoy doing? Yes. Something that requires the use of your brain? Yes. We get an office? Yes. Can I stop asking yes or no questions? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, okay. it's really, um, <clears throat> not a big deal. But a spot opened up as operations manager. I know, exciting. But it's not all that it's cracked up to be, but it is a pay raise which is very necessary, because I don't know about you, but I'm getting sick of those frozen dinners. Ugh, I dreamt about a steak last night with ice cream on the side. Okay, that's a little weird. I'm drowning now. What am I going to do when the baby comes? I'm going to need clothes. I'm going to need food. All right, listen. This job, okay, it's not going to get us a penthouse, but it's going to help, all right? And... <clears throat> dee -dee 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 -dee. One last thing for you to buy. What did you do? Okay, now there's no gift wrapping because, you know, it's not a holiday and that stuff is expensive, you know. Well, like, this thing wasn't? It's adorable. Do you like it? Do you really like it? Because it's supposed to boost IQ points. I love apparently. it. Yeah. Thank you. So tell me something. How did you know about this job? Well, I knew something was up with you the last week and a half. You've been doing that tapping thing. Okay, what are, you, what are you talking about? Tapping. Tapping a pencil, tapping your foot, tapping your fork. It always means you're, you know, ruminating. Plus, oh. you've been grinding your teeth in your sleep. Well, well, why didn't you tell me I've been doing this? Because the, the grinding of the teeth is going to stop after today. We can resist you in this tie, yeah? Yeah, well, thank you very much for the vote of confidence. Thank you for doing this. For, for not giving up. I'll never get that. I love her. I thought we were making headway with the therapist, you know? Listen, you can't expect things to change overnight. But days like this are a step in the right direction. And besides, you have to help investigate Zach's death. Kendall needs answers. We need to keep her safe. As long as you stay safe, too. If you need anything, I'm here. Daddy! 
Yeah. I need to tell you something. Oh, okay, what is it? Well, it's personal. I'll give you guys a minute. Okay. Come here, what's going on? Oh, I have a tummy ache. I want to go home. You do, huh? You know what it probably is? It probably is just the breakfast that we ate. Big breakfast. It'll pass, I promise, okay? Okay? You stay here, you have fun. Okay, love you. Okay, I'll be back. Stay here. So, what do you want to do first? Where's the TV? Madison. Um, I just want to say thank you for being such a great friend. Hey, when you get that raise, you can take me out for a steak. Yeah. Ice cream on the side. Of course. <laughs> Oh, Mr. Kepner. Is that? Yes, it is. Oh, may I, uh, mm -hmm. yeah? And when I noticed that Lorna had... Mr. Kepner, could you at least tell me why I didn't get the job? We thought Miss Price was a better fit. Oh, I mean, she's not half as qualified as I am, sir. With all due respect. I'm sorry. No, Mr. Kepner. Could you tell me the reason why I got passed over? We had some concerns about your record. The position for which you applied involves a great deal of confidential information about the hospital. Okay, sir, look, um, <clears throat> I made a mistake, okay? I made a mistake, and I paid for it. And now I'm just trying to work very, very hard to get my life back that on track, sir. That may be very true. Just, I need, I need a break. That's all. That's all I'm asking for. You're going to have to earn it. Of course, sir. Just tell me what I need to do, and I, and I will do it. Well, you can start by taking these forms to Dr. Griffin Castillo, have him fill them out, bring them back to me as soon as possible, please. Great. I guess that's a no. Can you fill those out, please? Make it quick. So that's what we call a prototype. We make changes based on the feedback we get. So you can actually help shape a fusion product. It's pretty cool, huh? Do you have any ideas for a new product? Really? None? I mean, I'd love to hear any idea you have. Something not ugly. Hey. Remember when I was talking to you in St. Bart's about how I wanted to be a family? Me, you, and Daddy? You said it a thousand times. Yeah, well, here's what I didn't say. I used to be just like you. Really, really angry. Except I was angry at my father. And I felt like I had every right to be because I felt betrayed, just like you do. But now, I'd give anything to have that time back. Take back all the mean and hurtful things I said. I was so focused on hating him that I couldn't see what I was missing. A chance to spend time with someone who really, really loved me. I missed out on so much, Emma. And if you hold on to this anger, you're going to miss out too. You could have fun. You could relax and smile and see that I really do want to make this work. Or you can hold on to this anger and shut me out and regret it forever. It's up to you. Well, I do want to have fun. Okay. So, how about we start with you telling me something that you do enjoy doing? Well, I like taking pictures with my new camera. <gasps> That's great! We have a photographer on staff. So why don't I set up some time in the studio, bring in some models, and let you shoot your own stuff. Does that sound good? Mm. Okay, cool. Madison, Greenlee's going to let me go to a photo shoot. Oh, that is so, so cool. You're going to have so much fun. Here, 
Here are some pictures from some other photo shoots we've done so you can get a sense of our style. Okay? Fusion. Hold, please. For you. Distributors. I'll be right back. You think I did it, don't you? Killed that Diana woman? I only know what I read in the papers. Doesn't look good. You're not up for jury duty anytime soon, are you? <sighs> yep. Just the delivery boy. And you just give me a taste of what's ahead. Life of nobody ever giving me the benefit of the doubt. Did you like the pictures? Hey, where are you going? Stop pretending! You'll never be my mommy! Never! What happened? Why are you so upset? Emma, wait! Emma, no! Wait, that's dangerous! Emma, don't go in there! Emma! Oh, my God. We'll get her out. No, you know. I, I got this. You go back to work. Emma, open. Push door. Uh, push open door now. Go away! Listen, you can lock yourself in an elevator or a room, but I am always going to be here. And I am tougher, and I am bigger than you. I can wait this out and... and I don't believe this. Not sure how much help I'll be, but uh, what do you got so far? Well, uh, not, not, not a ton. I haven't had a chance to look all the way through this, but what I know so far is Diana Holden was the VP at a company that Zach was partnered with. She was the face of the casino business. Very beautiful face, but mixed up in some really ugly stuff. Not sure what you mean. Well, um, she passed herself off as a legitimate businesswoman, but she was mixed up with some pretty bad people. People that might have actually murdered Zach. Wow. That's... that's crazy. And from what I can tell so far, she certainly knew how to cover her tracks. So what I'm going to look for in here is I'm going to look for any... Any evidence, any any proof that she was in fact involved in this? Excuse me. For yeah. One second, sorry. yeah. is still in the elevator? Well, the repair guy is working on it, and I'm going to get her out of there. You don't have to rush back over here. I'm on my way. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry about this. We're going to have to pick this up another time, OK? Uh, family emergency. Can I help? No, 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 I got it. Thank you. Hey, you want me to hang on to this? I can just finish going through everything. Ah, oh, no, that's fine. That's fine. Thank you. I, I better hang on to it. OK. OK. See you later. See you. We both know you didn't have a headache, Kendall. So where'd you go? I need your... Why can't you get these doors open? Could it take any longer? Oh, finally! Oh, oh. hey, are you all right? Emma, Emma, this needs to end. Look at me. These games, these tricks, it's not going to work with me. And you could have been really hurt. Hey, hey, hey. Are you okay? What is going on? How did you end up in an elevator that doesn't work? I don't know. Okay, we gotta talk. Were you giving Greenlee a hard time? No. Don't you lie to me. I was mad and I wanted to get away from her. So you ran into an elevator that's broken even though you know that's not safe? You don't want to say a word to me right now. Trust me. You're mad at me, Daddy. I'm frustrated. Mostly with myself for letting this behavior go on so long. It's going to stop, and it's going to stop today. <laughs>